In this tutorial, I'll show you how to reset your password should you get locked out of your blog for whatever reason. Uh, if you uh, go to your blog, for example, and you can't get logged in, you click log in, and you're the admin of your blog, uh, chances are your username is going to be admin. But if you can't get logged in, uh, you don't remember your password or it got reset somehow or whatever happened, uh, the first thing that you should try is to recover your password using the lost password feature on the login page. Now, if you look in the documentation at wordpress.org, you'll see if you search for resetting your password in the documentation area, you'll see several ways to reset your password. Uh, you can scroll down through here and they talk about several different ways with different versions. Everything from MySQL command line recovery uh, through PHP my admin uh, through an emergency script that uh, they have directions for uh, the procedures I'm going to talk about is uh, how to do it through PHP my admin and through just the uh, WordPress interface so first off let's demonstrate the WordPress interface because that confuses people sometimes uh, bottom line in order to reset your password you're going to get two separate emails here so if you can't get logged in if you're the admin chances are again your username is going to be admin so if you type in your username here either username or email address that you've used for your admin account and click get new password then WordPress will send an email to the email account that you have uh, entered in your admin account in WordPress so you're going to need access to that email account so if you go to that account then you should get an email from WordPress now, if you click on it, then the first thing it's going to tell you that you need to do is to click this link in order to get a password generated and sent to you. And that's a security feature just to make sure that you are who you say you are. So if I click this link, then it takes me back to WordPress, my blog, and that triggers an e another email to be sent to you with your new password in it. So uh, once you do that, then go back to your email account and it may take it a, a minute or two for this email to come in and wait for that second email so now here's the second email from WordPress and this email contains my username admin and my new password so I could copy that password from the second email and then go back to my login page and type in my username and enter that password and that should get me in if the password was the cause of the problem for me not being able to log into my blog and once you get logged in then you could if you wanted to go to your admin account and go down and change that password back to something that you can remember uh, if that doesn't work for you and there are several reasons that may not work you may not have access to the email anymore that's the admin email or there's something that may have gotten corrupted there or whatever um, but if that's not working then the second way or another way that you can go about changing your password is uh, through PHP my admin so I'll demonstrate that next so you can't get logged in if you go log in to PHP my admin and I'm going through cPanel but you go to PHP my admin however you normally get there if you have access to it find your database for your blog and click on the users table and then click browse to browse that table and then you will see all the users here in a list now I only have one user and it's the admin user but if you had several users you would see them all here and typically the admin user will be the first record in this uh, table but you find the user that has the user login as admin uh, and the password is going to be encrypted but all you need to do is click on the pencil to edit that record and then here in the password field you would delete what's there type in a new password I'm just going to put testing so I can remember it and then here under function change that to MD5 and that will rehash that will hash that password and encrypt it I'll click go and now it's happened I can go back and click browse if I want and I'll see now that my user password hash has changed 
but I don't use that. I use the uh, normal text password when I go to log in. So if you do that, then you should be able to go back to your blog, type in your username, and then type in that password that you just set. Testing in my case, and log in, and that should get you back into your blog. So two ways to do it is one through the uh, uh, change password feature within WordPress. If that doesn't work, and if you have access to PHP MyAdmin, it's very easy to go in and change your password there.